Mr. Guinea Pig's museum. Hey, Pinky! Look where I've been! Tyler, did you go to the museum of really old stuff today? Yep! Mommy Dingy Doo took me there to see a new dinosaur exhibit. It was amazing! We saw giant rooms filled with dinosaur bones, and dinosaur footprints, and dinosaur toenails, and dinosaur everything! Wow! It looks like a really big... Oh... What's that word for a group of things that go together? Oh, I know that word, Pinky. It's called a... Collection. Right. A group of things that go together is called a... Collection. Like all the dinosaur things at the museum. Man, I wish I could have something like that. Hmm. Wants to have a group of things. Tyler, that gives me an idea! Pinky, are you going to make up a story? Yes, sir, Rooney, pause it to it. Yes, sir, Rooney, pause it to me. We're going to the story box Where Pinky's really good at making up stories And every story rocks Story Box! <laughs> okay. So one day, in Great Big City, Pinky and Tyler got an invitation to visit Mr. Guinea Pig's house. But before they could go, they had to get a lot smaller. Daddy Dinky Doo! Hey, kids! Would you please shrink us? Sure, kids. Just remember to be big in time for lunch. wanted to show Pinky and Tyler the latest thing in his latest <laughs> collection. Pinky, Tyler, I'm so glad you could make it. Wow. wow. This is great, Mr. Guinea Pig. Yeah, it's like a museum in here. I'm glad you like it. What are these? Ah, that's dirt that I've saved from places I've traveled. Nice. And these are my buttons. And these are my dinosaur teeth. I really like them. Wow, Mr. Guinea Pig, I didn't know you had a... Collection of dinosaur teeth. What other kind of things do you have, Mr. Guinea Pig? I'm glad you asked, Pinky. I'm about to begin a brand new collection. Rocks that look like people. And these are my very first ones. Wow, these rocks do look familiar. Where did you get them? I found them in the park. The place is full of them. Hmm. So, where are you going to put them? Well, I hadn't thought about that. Nah, not here. Too crowded. <laughs>
that's something you don't see every day. That's not good! I'm really sorry this happened, Mr. Guinea Pig. Mr. Guinea Pig's things were everywhere. His museum was a mess. My museum is a mess! My... <laughs> collection is everywhere! Somebody do something! Hmm, looks like it's time for me to... Think big! Don't worry, Mr. Guinea Pig. Pink is gonna think big! If I have a problem, I don't know which way to go. I think and think and think and think. And suddenly I know. Come on, Pink! Pink! pink. pink. special things. To make room for new ones, why don't you carefully move out some of the old ones? That's perfect, Pinky! There are lots of things in my <laughs> collection that I can share with others! Like my guinea pig magazines and all my seashells! I'll take them to the Museum of Guinea Pig Stuff! And we can help you clean this all up! Yeah! carefully pack up his things and make room for his newest <laughs> collection. Then they helped him find just the right place for his new rocks. Perfect! My brand new <laughs> collection is now officially open! Woo! Yeah! That's exactly what happened. Pretty much the end. You know, Pinky, now that I think of it, I already have my own <laughs> collection. You do? Sure. I've got my crayons and my marbles. And don't forget all my funny socks. I'm going to put them out where everyone can see them. It sounds like you're going to have your own Tyler Dinky Doo Museum. <laughs> <laughs> that go together like this, shout out the word collection. Let's try it once. Ready? Collection! But when you see a picture of something that isn't a group of things that go together, shout no! No! Let's play. Collection! No! Super job! You really know your great big fancy words! Let's play a game called What Was My Big Idea? What was my big idea? In my made up story, Mr. Guinea Pig had a problem. He had too many collections and not enough space. And you came up with a great solution! Your big idea really helped! Thanks, Tyler! Do you remember what my big idea was? Shout yes when you see the right solution. And when you don't, shout no! 
Ready? Let's play! Was my big idea to put a frozen turkey on my head? No, that wasn't your big idea! It sure wasn't! What about this? Was my big idea to go to an animal party in Smack Dab Park? No, Pinky! It wasn't that! You're right! That wasn't my big idea either! What about this? Was my big idea to make space for Mr. Guinea Pig's new collection? Yes, Pinky! That was your big idea! We helped Mr. Guinea Pig share some of his collections to make space for his new ones! And it was a great solution to his problem! Thanks, little brother! Good job! What was my big idea? What was my big idea? In my made-up story, Mr. Guinea Pig had a problem. He had too many collections and not enough space. And you came up with a great solution. Your big idea really helped. Thanks, Tyler. Do you remember what my big idea was? Shout yes when you see the right solution. And when you don't, shout no! Ready? Let's play! Was my big idea to put a frozen turkey on my head? No, that wasn't your big idea! It sure wasn't! What about this? Was my big idea to go to an animal party in Smack Dab Park? No, Pinky! It wasn't that! You're right! That wasn't my big idea either! What about this? Was my big idea to make space for Mr. Guinea Pig's new collection? Yes, Pinky! That was your big idea! We helped Mr. Guinea Pig share some of his collections to make space for his new ones! And it was a great solution to his problem! Thanks, little brother! Good job! I love making up stories, and I bet you can make up a story, too.